What's going on YouTube? Connor on Chain here. I'm gonna be talking to you guys about meme coins again. I know a lot of you guys might think it's bullshit. Probably saying, why are you not talking? Why are you talking about meme coins? Why are you not talking about solid projects? Well, I'm gonna tell you today because meme coins have honestly been taking off on Twitter, and I know a lot of you guys really aren't on Twitter like that. But like I say in my videos, I tell you guys, jump on Twitter, get on Twitter, and just. Honestly, you guys got to start getting into the NFT side of it as well. Because a lot of NFT people that are in the crypto space are very heavily focused on meme coins and a lot of crypto projects too. Um, but mainly on Twitter, like a lot of the people that I follow, you know, they're heavily invested in meme coins. And in the NFT space, meme coins themselves are such a subculture and it's been absolutely insane seeing some of the moves that these projects have been making. Like, I'm just going to pull up my X feed right now. Um, you know, I'm going to talk about a bunch of meme coins that have pumped, that have dropped. <coughs> you know, over like the last, whatever, maybe a few days to a week. You know, you can just pull through. Like, just if you guys are interested, just follow half these people that are on my feed right now. And like shout out to Takashi's return. This man, I I respect this man so hard for some of the gems that he finds. He knows what he's talking about. Absolute animal. But like, look at this. Like you can just see half these are just filled with <clears throat> straight up meme coins. But you know, a lot of times I'm seeing a lot of projects being shilled. So this is one that's been shilled a lot. It's called Doug. And I understand a lot of these meme coins too. People are getting paid to talk about them. But when opportunities arise to get into these meme coins, sometimes these are the ones that are going to pay off. But specifically today, I'm going to be talking about these coins. I don't want them to be buy signals. You know, all of these are very, very high risk. Like they are higher risk than a lot of the micro caps, you know, sub $1 million micro caps that I'm talking about. Because at the end of the day, these meme coins... You know, these, they're not real companies. They're not businesses trying to build themselves from the ground up. These are random people that are starting new Twitter accounts, launching a, you know, a shit coin, just whether they want to do it as a joke or they want to just try to rug people, you know, it's very, very risky doing what I'm going to be telling you guys today. And I want you to know that way ahead of time, because I'm not invested in any of these, except one that I'm going to show you at the end. But these are just projects that have been on my radar that I kind of want to talk about today. So this first one was Doug. And like, yo, like I say all the time too. You guys want to look into a project, see what the hype's about. Go on Twitter, just type in the ticker. So if, <laughs> so if you guys have ever watched The King of Queens, or I don't know if he's in other shows. Well, this is Doug. This is literally... <laughs> This is legit what this meme coin's about. Um, you know, there's not much to say. Most of these meme coins are run based off of memes. Another one is Flecker right here. This shit's been moving. You know, like aside from like real utility and projects that I'm in, like this, I think to me, meme coins is just what makes crypto fun. I'm not saying you got to invest in everything. But, you know, I found a project that Obviously, I think is the one for me, the long-term hold that is going to make six figures minimum. And, you know, these are just coins. Again, I'm going to be bringing up. This was Doug. The Doug chart obviously just looks like a straight up cash grab, pump and dump. But, you know, it just, it pumped. It had to move and it's come back down. Again, I'm not buying this at all. I'm not even going to be looking remotely close to buying this anytime soon. I just think the memes are hilarious to be seeing that. Another one that actually was recently launched was Bay. So the ticker was BAE. Which I don't know if it was. I actually don't know if it was this. It, yeah, it could have been. Because it was only a few days ago. Well, again. So what are we doing? We're kind of curious. So we're going to peep it. Let's check out Bay on Twitter right now. So it is base systems Inu. 
But again, this is another meme. It's just funny. You know, you got some like decent people talking about it. It's just, bro. This is what I, this is. This is like the takeover of meme coins, though, and culture coins. Like everything has just changed. Like people are not talking about me, uh, Dogecoin. They're not talking about Shiba Inu. I think even Pepe already, even though it had its run months ago, I think Pepe itself is like dead. Like if you're looking to buy Pepe as like your top meme coin, like I've talked about it before. You know, it's I think it's a solid meme coin. It's gonna be the next meme coin that's gonna push into billions of dollars. But you know, aside from that Pepe movement. You know, if you dig deep under in the meme coin space, like I am here, these are a lot of the coins that are going to be eventually taken off, you know. Another one is LMI, which is Lockheed, Martin, Inu. This, I don't even know too much about it. Seen this ticker just on Twitter sometimes. But it's just, I think it's hilarious, bro, seeing some of these memes. Another one, too, and I don't, I'm not even going to bring up another one, but... So obviously the one that I'm most bullish on is Mog. M O G. So we're gonna search it, queue it up, bro. I'm glad it's like not loading, which is sweet. That was Bay. Lockheed. I don't even know what LMI is. Another one is Ardvark. I'll pull up Mog in a second, but Ardvark is another one. They actually just switched their contract address. So they changed. But this has just been dropping a lot. But, I mean, from a new contract, a new new coin they launched, basically, it's like, you, I gotta expect a little dump until things go up. And again, the meme coin sector, bro, this is a different breed of pump and dump. If you're not buying in when the hype is dead, you're going to get burned. Do not invest when prices are up because it's going to dump. I'm telling you now. You have to play it 10 times safer when you're dealing with meme coins than when you're dealing with real coins, which is why, you know, there's a lot of DGENs on Twitter, right? But I don't know. If you guys don't understand what MOG is here, though, it's, it's the Vipers, bro, the Pit Vipers. I'm literally going to grab a pair eventually pretty soon. You know, but MOG is just, it's been, I really just think MOG is going to be the next major, major culture coins. I just have a lot of conviction. Another one was Joe that just popped off. Don't know anything about the Joe coin, but nor am I going to look into it today. And there's another one here, I think it's called like something Smurf, Blue Smurf or some random shit. Not looking into that either. You know, a lot of them are just random memes. It's like, it doesn't even matter what they are. But again, like, this is kind of what it is, bro. And like I was saying, Aardvark is another one that's really big. Another one that I've actually been watching is, um, it's called, the ticker is Solana. You know, a lot of people might hate me for this, but... This is ticker Solana. I think it's hilarious. It's actually coming back down to... Potential buy levels, but I'm gonna put it like here because literally this could drop under a million dollars in market cap like nothing Even though it's sitting right here But this project I think it's just hilarious to some of the memes here Because uh, they actually got nfts too They're called like the crash bandicoots I actually want to pull those up because yo, this is just a fun funny video. I don't even care like, I'm just messing around right now. Like, this is what I'm, when I'm not really making, like, solid content on real projects and stuff, bro. If I'm just dicking around on Twitter, th this is the shit that I'm watching and looking at, you know? Because it's just fun. It makes crypto fun, like I said. And I think when you fade communities, that's, like, that's one of the biggest things to not fade. Like, you, you're, you're just going to lose potential tens, if not hundreds of Xs on fading communities. You know, so we're gonna type in Sol um, Solana. But I guess part of the meme, though, and obviously you guys have heard of Ticker Bitcoin. Or obviously, uh, I can't say obviously, but Ticker Bitcoin is another one. That's one of the most major ones. I'm gonna pull up two more. But yeah, right here, these are the the NFTs. There, Cooters. 
This, I think, long term. I think these are going to be hilarious, bro. But these are just ridiculous. Like, I'm buying... Like, I'm in a lot of these... Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not in a lot of these. I'm in this NFT. But aside from that, I'm not in any of these coins. Aside from Mog in this NFT right now. I'm not even in this coin, Solana. I just find it hilarious. Like, of course, they don't even have that many, like, show in here. But just to give you an idea, this is what they look like. They're kind of just... A little bit special there you know they're something up with them you know but I think it's this part of the culture so another one too that's been very big is called SPX the ticker is SPX you know and I think the the reason why they're so big obviously is because of their tickers you know the font like the the initial joke of it was when people are going to buy, say, Bitcoin or they want to buy Solana, and say they're on a DEX and they don't know better, you know, they're going to type in Solana. They might not even look at what the coin symbol looks like and they're just going to buy the meme coin instead, you know, instead of buying actual Solana or actual Bitcoin, you know, and that's kind of what this is with SPX. Like the ticker is, you know, the S&P 500 basically, which is like... If you don't know what the S and P 500 is, look that up, please. But another, this was another funny one too. SPX community is crazy. I fuck with them. But this is the biggest one. Is Bitcoin. This was like this and Mog were the original. Um. Well, where's the chart though? Oh, it's just absolutely ripped. Yeah, this is what the charts look like. It's it's actually had a crazy run thus far, but I, I don't think it's I don't think it's over yet. Cause like I've talked about in my old meme coin video, it was Pepe, I think it was Ticker Bitcoin, and then uh, Mog were the top three. But I still think risk to reward reward wise, Mog is like a hundred percent killing it. But anyways, that is kind of all I got for you today. Again, I'm not advising you guys to buy any of these. If you have a Twitter, just start typing in these tickers. Like, the ticker on this one is literally Bitcoin. Like, just type in these meme coins and learn about them. Because honestly, if you start really diving deeper into some of these memes and you find them funny, you like the community, you start posting about it, you know, the community will instantly reach out and start following and interacting with you, you know. Like it, it's that's part of the game is community, bro, and that's what these meme coins are bringing to the table. You know the ones that I've given you so far, from what I know, are not really scams. They're not rugs. You know we don't really know a lot of the owners or founders, but what we do know is the social sentiment has come to a consensus that these coins are fairly solid. They're here to stay. You know, and they're they like they are what they are basically. So. Check all these out. Um, stay very cautious with projects like this. And do your research, please. Because these were not buy signals. Oh, and you know what? One more, too. This is a project I'm going to eventually get in. This is a funny, brand new one. It's at a great buy zone. Looking into RMD. This one's funny on Twitter, too. Yeah, Redneck Mountain Dew, baby. Super solid, just... They just got funny-ass memes, too. Like, long-term, I think it's it's the move, so... Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Go check out all these meme coins I'm showing you. Just go have fun. You know, join some communities, even... Whatever, you don't even have to buy any of these coins. Just start following people. Start tweeting about these coins. Whatever you find fun, whatever people or communities you find most genuine. I promise you, you're going to have enjoy crypto a lot more if you're on Twitter and just, you know, actively engaging with communities like that. So that's why I'm here with meme coins and that's why I'm here for the culture. So that's all I got for you guys today for right now. I appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you in the next video.